During your regular tune-up, finding oil on the spark plugs might surprise you. This typically means there's a mechanical problem, but how do you know what's causing it? So in this video, we will talk about eight common reasons for oil on spark plugs and show you how to fix it. Let's get started. Reason number one, leaking valve cover gasket. If oil has seeped into the wells or is found on the spark plug threads, your issue might be due to a leaking valve cover gasket. The valve cover gasket is responsible for sealing the engine's oil, but over time, the gasket ages and deteriorates, making it more susceptible to leaks. Reason number two, worn intake valve seals. The cylinder heads contain intake valves that let air into the engine and help release exhaust gases. Each valve has a stem inside the cylinder head. Valve seals prevent oil from entering the combustion chamber through the guides. But if these seals or guides wear out, oil can get into the system and mess up the plugs. You might notice your engine using more oil, especially when you start it up, and see smoke from the exhaust. Reason number three, bad or clogged PCV valve. If the PCV valve becomes clogged or fails, the system may start siphoning oil. This issue causes an increase in vapors and can clog the spark plugs with oil. All modern automobiles have a positive crankcase ventilation, PCV system, and its goal is to reduce emissions while keeping the environment as clean as possible. This also aids in rerouting them so that they can be reburned in the engine. Reason number four, clogged crankcase ventilation. Oil leaks can occur if the pressures in the crankcase ventilation become too high. Crankcase ventilation is designed to relieve pressure in the crankcase caused by blow-by gases. This system also redirects the gases back to the intake manifold, where they can serve as fuel for the engine. A clogged crankcase ventilation system can cause the same symptoms as a faulty PCV valve. Often, the pressures increase due to a blockage. You may also observe a decline in engine performance and a higher idle than usual. Reason number five, faulty head gasket. A blown or faulty head gasket can allow oil to leak into the cylinders and onto the spark plugs. This happens because the head gasket seals the cylinders, preventing oil from entering. When the head gasket fails, it can create gaps or cracks, allowing oil to seep through and contaminate the spark plugs. This can lead to misfires, rough idling, and reduced engine performance. Reason number six, bad piston rings. These rings are intended to last the entire engine's lifespan, but that doesn't always happen. The piston rings in the cylinder are in charge of maintaining compression and preventing oil leakage into the combustion chamber. When a piston ring is worn out or damaged, it allows oil to pass through the seal. This oil then enters the combustion chamber, leading to clogged spark plugs. Reason number seven, bad pistons. Another thing to look out for is the pistons. These are the parts in the engine that move up and down. If one of them gets weak or cracked, oil can leak from the bottom of the engine into where the fuel burns. This messes up the spark plug, which is what ignites the fuel to make the car go. Reason number eight, bad turbocharger. A turbocharger can give your car a nice boost, but if you're seeing oil on the spark plugs, it might mean the turbocharger is failing. The seals around the turbine shaft can wear out from the heat, allowing oil to leak into the intake and combustion chamber and onto the spark plugs. Fixing a blown turbocharger means getting a replacement, which can be expensive. How to fix this issue? To fix oil on spark plugs first, figure out where the oil is coming from, inside the cylinder or from above. Don't just swap out the plugs. Fix the underlying issue to avoid bigger engine problems down the line. Clean out the ventilation hoses and PCV valve thoroughly. Check for any blockages and replace any worn out parts. Consider doing a leak down test to identify any blow by issues. If you're not confident, it's best to get a professional to take a look. So there you have it. If you find videos like this helpful, make sure to like and subscribe so we can assist you. Fix it.